This video presents learning quadrupedal locomotion with impaired joints using random joint masking. Existing algorithms demonstrate high performance in terms of locomotion ability. However, due to sudden disturbances or internal failures, the robot can malfunction at any time. Existing algorithms cannot prepare for sudden water failures. On the other hand, we employ reinforcement learning in simulation to train the locomotion of a quadrupedal robot with impaired joints using a random joint masking strategy. We introduce impaired joint scenarios to the robot by randomly masking joint actions. Additionally, in order to enable the robot to estimate its current joint status based on its observation history, we employ imitation learning between a teacher and a student using latent vectors. The Polish network which takes latent vectors and observations as inputs is a multi-layer perceptron and produces a 12-dimensional actions as output. In our study, we use the reward functions from previous studies. However, the three terms highlighted in yellow work well for normal locomotion but are not suitable for abnormal locomotion. So, when we were training for abnormal locomotion, we did not use these three terms. Additionally, we proposed a progressive curriculum learning strategy to enable comprehensive locomotion ability for a normal joint and various impaired joint conditions. We validate the performance through experiments indoors using motion capture equipment. As a result, we verify that both normal locomotion and abnormal locomotion are achievable within a single policy, yielding satisfactory performance. Finally, we confirmed satisfactory performance outdoors as well through two courses within the campus. Course 1 consists of center incline, decline, and level areas with clean and hard ground. Course 2 is deformable ground covered with soft glass and small pebbles. As a result, our proposed framework enables the quadrupedal robot to maintain stable and reliable locomotion capability, even under various impaired joint conditions. Thanks for watching.